The simple explanation from the accused is that shooting the deceased dead was a genuine mistake as he thought he was shooting at an intruder behind the toilet door. The timelines as set out in the chronology of events tip the scales in favor of the accused version in general. Viewed in its totality, the evidence failed to establish that the accused had the requisite intention to kill the deceased, let alone with premeditation. I am here talking about a direct intention. The state clearly has not proved beyond reasonable doubt that the accused is guilty of premeditated murder. There is just there are just not enough facts to support such a finding.